straight back with another video guys this time we've got a comparison video i'm going to compare today with you the 100 pound genuine authentic versus the fake authentic from dh gate Right now, we're going to go straight into the Adidas logo. This is the genuine. And this is the fake. Not bad. Well, similar thing, really. Then we're going to go into the genuine crest. United badge. That's the genuine. This is the fake. It's got a slight fold on it because that's the way it was posted. Looks slightly off colour there to me, but... Yeah, there's a slight colour difference to the fake from the genuine. The team view is the same. And we've got the sleeve detail. This is the genuine. This is the fake. The fake is slightly bigger. They've done it too thick, too wide rather. See that? The sleeve itself is bigger than the genuine. Let's go into the collar detail there on the, that's the genuine authentic. This is a large version, by the way. And like always, you're supposed to size up on the DH gate fakes, which I have done. This is an extra large. But if you look at that, it's more like a medium to me that. But yeah, it is what it is. DH gate, what do you expect? Let's go into the gold trim detail. That's the genuine. This is the fake. The fake is slightly duller gold colour. You can tell that straight away. There's a bit of a flaw there with the gold stitching coming through. Which you'd probably expect from a fake. They're not really quality assured, are they? <laughs> But you've got a hundred pound version here. Or you've got a 14 pound version here. Not much difference, I'll tell you that. It's quite impressive. If you was to have this shirt on, on a match day, there's not many people that know it's a fake. Not many people at all. In fact, I've actually forgot to go into the main thing, which is this. This is the genuine, that's holographic. There. I don't think the camera shows that, but the fake is obviously not holographic. It's just one block colour. Also the heat ready. That's the genuine. That's the fake. Oh, I need to also do the red devil on the back. That's the genuine. And this is the fake. Comes with a fake tag there. Everything is the same, pretty much. It's just the slight difference in the quality of it all, which is obviously and it's going to be a thing in it. You're buying a hundred pound or a fourteen pound one, aren't you? Are you going to buy the genuine for a hundred, or are you going to buy the fake for fourteen pound? <laughs> I'm quite lucky in that I've got both. Can wear one for playing football in, can wear one for 
best. Once again, last run, the genuine. And the fake. Just ignore that there. There's just a crease the way it was posted, that's all. That'll probably iron out. Oh, but one thing I must end this video on is, obviously I've, I've mentioned the sizing's way off, which it is. The genuine, this one genuine is a large. This fake is an extra large. It's nowhere near an extra large. But what I will say is look at the contour shape. Look at the contour shape on the genuine and look at it on the fake. It's way off. So I'm guessing this will be much more tighter, much more tighter fit than the genuine. But there you go, guys. Nice little DH gate fake comparison for you. And I hope you like this video. Let me know, leave a comment if you have any questions. And I'll see you in the next video, guys. Thanks a lot for watching.